Yo, what's good, homies at home? It's your boy King Coop here, and this is for all my um, followers or subscribers or whatever, or just people in general trying to lose weight. Avoid fast food restaurants wherever you can because, ooh, let me tell you, I've had a bad few weeks as far as eating habits. Well, not even a few weeks. I would say a bad week or so of eating habits and everything. It was already bad enough that I put on five pounds beforehand because I started this month at like, well, late last month I was 237. Then I started this month, early this month at 242. Now I'm back up to about 246, 247 pounds. Um, I decided to go to Hardee's and get food that lasts maybe a couple of days just because I was like, oh, well, you know what? Let me try something different. You never know how much fat or grease is in Hardee's food, fast food in general. So be careful what you eat. Like chicken sandwiches. I only had two chicken sandwiches, what, maybe the other day? And that was like my meal for that day. And then a couple days before that, I got like a 20 piece from like a 20 piece, like tw chicken tenders from Hardee's. And I made those last two days. Took 10 a.m. one night, 10 a.m. the other night. And the thing is, I was still working out during that time too and i still really put on a little bit of weight and i'm like you gotta be careful with what you eat and how you eat because you never know what's a fast food and that was the first time i had fast food in like over a year over a year and it's something it really is but you gotta be careful what you eat if you're looking to lose weight or trying to maintain your shape stick with baked foods like baked chicken um, cauliflower pizza, plant-based foods, like that's why I do, salads, um, vegetables, canned fruits, or, yeah, just canned fruits, but, um, that's something, if you have a sweet craving or something, get something like graham crackers, or something that's not really too high in fat, but, um, yeah, don't risk your health just for a couple like minutes of so-called good food food that tastes good to the tongue or the palate or whatever whatever you want to say food that tastes good to the body whatever don't waste time with that because in the end you gotta think about clogged arteries upset stomach messed up like extra fat that wasn't there before your health is now worth a few minutes of savory so-called savory foods you know but um yeah Anyway, I just want to let y'all know what was going on and everything, what was on my mind, and that was definitely on my mind, because I was sitting around thinking about it, and I'm like, I need to let other people know before they make that same mistake. I mean, it's nothing wrong with taking at least 15, 20, 25 minutes to prepare a meal, a healthy meal, and actually eat it. But um, that's it for now, and until next time, much love, stay cool, y'all, stay safe, peace.